So this is a fun game that was born from watching my students play paper football um, last year. And my memories of playing football as a middle schooler, paper football in middle school and high school, um, you know, way back when. So I thought it might be a fun way to teach something about angles um, and estimation to make an online paper football game. And so the, this requires two players. The first thing you do is click play. You can pick from real NFL teams. And so let's choose to randomly choose San Diego Chargers against the Cincinnati Bengals. And the maximum score means uh, at what point will somebody win the game? So the first person to 18 wins the game since you can only score sixes. Things, the amount of points in a touchdown. So I click start game. And you see the Chargers go first. You see this little line here. This is a crack in the table. You want to avoid that because it slows the football down. Here's how you control the football on the right. So player one's turn, the San Diego uh, Chargers, is you're going to make an angle. You want to angle it away from this crack at about 10 degrees, I'd estimate. Distance here, I'd go for the distance theoretically between here and here is about 500. So let's go with a little less. Let's go at 450, and let's spin it at a. Let's spin it. Let's give it a four for the amount it spins or rotates. So I click push football. There it goes. Pretty good push, but not quite. I needed. I probably need that full 500. So here I'm. Here I am. Um, here's the crack. I don't need to avoid it. It's a straight shot to the edge of the table. Let's do. 450, and give it a one spin, click push football, touchdown. So I score. So the Bengals are up 6 nothing. So now it's the San Diego Chargers turn. This time we're going to angle it. Okay, I'm going to angle this at maybe a little bit less at 6. This time the distance, let's make it... We go all the way up to 500. See if I can tie this up. So I push the football, and not quite. I need a little bit more. So now the Bengals don't need any angle. Let's go with 470. With a spin of two, push the football. Oh, almost. Not quite. Um, we're going to go back with the Chargers. No, we don't need any angle. Let's do a distance of about four. Let's go 500. Let's go 490. Spin it two. Straight shot. Push it down. And I score a touchdown. So it's 6-6. Six, six. Now watch this crack will move sometimes. So you just can't always do the same thing. Let's go with 500 here. And I think it's a straight shot. Oh, see, I went over the crack a little bit. Okay, so now the Chargers have a little bit of an easier shot, but it's a very bad angle. I want to make as much angle here as I can because I'm really close to that crack. I'm going to do a 25-degree angle. I really risk pushing it over the side. I'm going to put a lot of spin on it too, so let's see. Push the football. All right, well... I didn't have a good shot there. I gave the Bengals a pretty decent opportunity. Let's go with 350, two spin, no angle, push the football. I pushed it too hard. Back to San Diego. Now look, the crack goes in the middle. And so kids will have a lot of fun playing this. Some kids will get really good at estimating um, angle, distance, and the spin they need. Um, as you see right now, the score is tied 6-6. Six, six. We set it so that the first um, team to get 18 or three scores win. This is a really good game. Um, uh, it just it, it sort of um, reinforces mathematical proficiency and estimation. Um, so I hope your kids like paper football now that the paper, now that the NFL football season is is coming quickly. Um, let me know what you think.